Is that a legendary? I don't even know. <laughs> Man. I'll, I'll look it up while, while she's healing me. and white and yeah it's a legendary <laughs> man running into a legendary in these randomizers is always scary like shaman I don't know if that really counts because you know shaman it's kind of weak but this uh this was a little scarier, <laughs> I'd say. But we're not done. We're not done leveling up. <clears throat> it seems like that's a rare encounter. Not very common, so... some progress at some point. Maybe I'll just stop at 15. And I do want to level up Autism and Anon also. Just put Anon out front. Whoops! Didn't mean to do that. Oh well. <laughs> Just wanted to see if I already had a fire type move. get some levels just from that. Yeah, level 9, level 10, Ember. Yeah, I'm not really feeling like a mirror match here. Thank 
Let's see, where should I try to get a non an autism up to? Maybe 13? Number 13 should be good. I think that's around where the gym was, so that'll have them all caught up. back a lot of memories. Using Shaman is a good way to get levels right now. Quick attack, yeah. We'll get rid of... Uh, Leer, maybe? Or we could just get rid of Tackle. Uh, I think this version doesn't let you look at the, the move details at this part, which kind of sucks. Oh wait, you know, it does. All right, so that's 100 accuracy. That's also 100 accuracy. 50 power. That's 40 power. Uh, we'll get rid of Leer for now. Keep smoke screen. Racking up the levels. This is a pretty good place to grind, so I, uh, I'll take it while I can. I don't know what's coming next. Well, uh, I don't really want to mess with that. Hey, Cashline. Uh, thanks. I'm mostly just grinding right now after the first gym, so. I, I did run into a pretty dangerous encounter earlier, but so far it's been easy going.
I think we'll get him to 15. Maybe 16. If we run into a shaman or something. Just hope we don't run into that legendary again. That was scary. Jameson. <laughs> from my from my Ruby playthrough. Alright. Um, he is ice and water. I doubt he knows the ice move right now. So I'll just hit him with some of the attacks. Didn't hurt too bad. <sighs> Piece of shit. Okay. Autism? Do some more wing attacks. We should be able to handle them now. Alright, we did it. Jameson was strong. Alright, non EDMs level 15 is good. So I'll heal and then level autism. And then we'll move on. We'll be ready to make some progress. Just sucks because autism doesn't really have any real attacking moves. He has like poison sting, but that's what, like 30 power? Thank you. 
Let's just find a shaman or something. Hell yeah. Let's hit him with some poison stings. So, so far, Shaman has only used growth. So, is it safe to assume that that's the only move it knows? Probably not. Astonish a priority move. I'll try. I guess it doesn't matter. I just get nervous. I don't trust it to only have growth. So it looks like it's flying, so I don't think Mud Slap would work. And maybe I should just switch out. Switch out to who? Cash line? Sure. like autism to learn a real attack, <laughs> but I don't know. I don't want to stick around here too long. Cedra. I'll send out Angela and just try to hit it with a wing attack. Take it down that way. I don't have anything that's good against water types yet. Until a Ferrothorn learns a grass move, I'm just kind of screwed.
don't want her to die from poison. It doesn't look like she's taking damage. Do they just not take damage outside of battle on this one? I guess not. Either way, I'm just gonna keep going. I will make progress. Hopefully autism can just get some levels on the way. Or I can just catch something better. That's also an option. Alright, you let me through yet? Scientist Fennel was looking for you a little while ago. I already talked to her. I got her her mist. I guess I have to go back. Talk to her again. Ta-da! Thanks to you, I got some dream mist. And now I can collect save files of various trainers. Thank you very much. As a token of my appreciation, I'll give you the sea gear to use. The Sea Gear is a device related to communications, such as infrared connection or a Nintendo Wi-Fi connection. Oh man, I wonder if anyone's on Wi-Fi right now. Please turn Sea Gear off in places such as airplanes and hospitals where wireless communications are prohibited. Uh, yeah, let's turn it on. Is, is anyone home? See, the sea gear was activated and that screen showed up. If you touch the question mark icon at the bottom right of the screen, you can read about the sea gear. About GameSync, I'd like to explain a little more about the system to collect trainer save files. Do you have time to learn more? Uh, no. I think I'm good. I'm sorry. I'm so happy, so I'll explain about it. What? She's doing it anyway? Because thanks to you, we can do a great thing. Now GameSync can retrieve memories of sleeping Pokemon using Dream Mist. That's right, we can collect save files of trainers from all over the world. What's more, we've learned that if you use GameSync to make a Pokemon sleep, it will have dreams. Then when you wake up that Pokemon, its dream becomes the reality in a space called Entralink in the middle of the Unova region. Isn't GameSync interesting? If you like, please send your save file. I've summed up the details in the PC, so please check it if you get the chance. Oh, trainer, thank you very much for helping Fennel. This is for me. Please take it. Don't be shy. Yeah, I love rhetorical questions. The pal pad. You can register your friends in your pal pad. After you register, you can link with those friends over Nintendo Wi-Fi connection to do all kinds of fun things. You can trade Pokemon, challenge your friends to a battle, and so on. Let me give you a quick how-to on registering your friends. I don't have friends. You can either input your friend's code directly by using your pal pad, or you can use the infrared connection feature of the sea gear. And then you can register your friend. Great. Um, I guess the screen is just like this now. I don't know. <laughs> I don't have any bars. Route 3. We can catch something here. This is the daycare. Pokemon battling is very popular at this daycare. If you go to, in the playground, you'll be pestered into battling. Oh, I guess this is the playground. Okay. I feel invincible because I'm surrounded by the smiles of children and Pokemon. some things about that Pokemon.
good thing he's missing all those tail whips. Level 16. Missed. I don't remember what mist does. Let's see. You should cloak its body with a white mist that prevents any of its stats from being cut for five turns. Useful, but not also not really. <laughs> yeah, I think I'll just get rid of it, not learn it. What's that? Electric? Water electric, maybe, I think, if I'm remembering right. It's fine. Wow, great, great. You're very strong. Yeah, I know. 